Well, the big race weekend is finally here and NASCAR fans and drivers are making their way up to Watkins Glen International for the big races. And right now, WNY's Ryan Belt is live up at the track with events happening today. Hey, Ryan. Hey there, Sam. Yeah, campers began rolling in yesterday. Over 40,000 fans will be camping throughout the area, and the cars start to hit the track later today as the Xfinity Series haulers entered the track this morning. They'll take to the track for the Could first two of their three practice sessions TV today at 1 and 3 o'clock. Hey, and then, open in your if you're not IP? up here at Watkins Glen International and you still want to experience the fun that NASCAR Weekend has to offer, Danica Patrick will be at the Wegmans in Ithaca this evening from 4.30 to 6. The bad news, though, you need a ticket, and they are sold out. It was first come, first serve. So if you got one, good for you. If not, another opportunity is in store. If you head over to the Walmart in Watkins Glen, another Stuart Haas driver, Kevin Harvick, NASCAR champion, will be there this evening from 5 o'clock till 7 this evening, signing autographs, taking some pictures with the fans, and you do need a wristband for that event. Those wristbands will start being given out at 3 o'clock, so get there early if you want to meet the NASCAR champion, Kevin Harvick. And then we also have some of the H. Scott Motorsports drivers going out and visiting with some of their local uh, younger fans trying to get the younger generation involved in the sport of NASCAR. Harrison Burton, Tyler Dipple, and Hunter Blaze will be heading over to the Laurel Richardson Huntington Youth Center this evening to meet with their young fans, take some pictures with them, and try to Looks great. Thanks, Ryan. And a now former Washington Transit police officer faces charges of trying to help ISIS. The arrest of Nicholas Young marks the first time a law enforcement officer has been charged in connection to a terror to a terror to a terror.